this amazing breakfast. Here is one of my favorites. This recipe is called shakshuka. This always, always hits a spot whenever I am craving for it. Hello everyone, this is Odyssey. I'm going to take you with me. We're going on some picnic today. Summer this year had really been great and was actually long compared to the summer last year. This was back in August. We were out for some picnic and here's one of those memories. We were out in the sun. I oh, know. <laughs> one. <laughs> Being able to spend with nature like this, being able to live in a foreign country and not just all about work, but these kind of moments that we try to explore more about their culture, what they do in each change of season, what activities do they look forward to, that idea that this foreign country kind of feels more like a home now, starts to settle in our minds. <laughs> get reminded and how difficult it was in the first year. The first year was more like trying to touch base in every aspect of a new life, like knowing even the simplest of things such as which dress is appropriate for the weather, the favorite brand in the grocery, how they all taste different. If you've been living in another country your whole life and then you moved abroad, it felt like the world opened up bigger for you. You get curious about the difference in their culture. You try to study and observe this different way of living and trying to fit in. It felt like you were a kid trying to adapt. Hello, what's up? I think once you're done with that phase, you now tend to open up in a more unique kind of way, that fusion of the difference in our culture. Still, we'll always feel like a foreigner in this country, but it no longer bothers you if you're different. We are all just people anyways. And it's one of the best and weird feelings to have at the same time. When you get to express your background, your own culture, without the need now of fitting in and just letting your own self open up to this different world. You kind of get to know yourself a little more, you know, which clothes you own are perfect for the weather, you already have that certain brand that you like, you already memorize the aisles where you need to get certain things. And we may be miles away from home, but as we settle, this also feels like home. I wonder how autumn this year would be like. 
it's actually here already and had brought in some rain this past couple of days but i get to be excited now when the season changes it's like you have something to look forward to every three months and each season each year is a little different from the other so it's kind of embracing the unknown will this be my favorite summer or will this be not will we get more snow this year or not so here is us saying goodbye to summer and hello autumn